Hello, and thank you for joining SciStream's virtual demonstration at this year's 3D Body Tech Conference. For this presentation, we'd like to begin by telling you a little bit about SciStream, walk through some of our different solutions, and then wrap up with a live Q&A. For those of you who are not familiar, SciStream is based out of Cary, North Carolina, right outside of Raleigh, and is a wholly owned subsidiary of the Apparel Group in Hong Kong, and has been since our inception in 2012. So as we'll see shortly, we're more than just a body scanning company. Our mission is to connect your body with better fitting goods and services. Really taking 3D body scans is just the beginning. Once those measurements are acquired, our platform allows users to then share that data with other businesses who will provide those better fitting goods and services. So our technology and solutions can be broken down into three categories, booth scanning, mobile scanning, and measurement extraction. Booth scanning has been at the heart of our business since 2012. Until recently, our SS20 model has been our traditional method for capturing body measurements. While this system is robust, it's not necessarily designed to be broken down and taken from location to location. And it can also be costly for new businesses looking for a 3D solution. With that in mind, we've taken the five key ingredients that go into our technology, speed, accuracy, personalization, scalability, and simplicity, and designed a new booth that has matched depth sensor capability of the SS20. You heard this announced at the opening session and we're excited to say it again, our SciStream Bit Booth. With this lightweight, lower cost option, we're hoping to eliminate some of the pain points and bring 3D scanning opportunity to more businesses everywhere. We're looking to have the Fit Booth available by the end of the year, and we'd like to invite those who are attending the conference live to stop by and check it out. So with our booth scanners, we've covered three specific industries. We've had the health, wellness, and fitness industry, made to measure and apparel, and also the uniform industry as well. So while we've covered these with our booth options, we've also been working hard to develop mobile options that are more individually tailored to these verticals. For the health and fitness industry, we have Made360. For the made to measure and apparel industry, we have FormCut. And then newly announced at this conference for the uniform industry, we have SciStream Mobile Fit. So we'll go over the differences between the apps in a little bit, but we wanted to first show you what the mobile scan process looks like as it is the same amongst each of them. Here's a demonstration from our newest app, Mobile Fit. We've also implemented several pose capturing techniques to allow the user to get the best scan possible. Place phone at need to waist level and point at an uncluttered area where you wish to stand. You will need room at your sides to raise your arms. All set. Let us begin. Stand with your feet shoulder width apart and your hands out to your sides with elbows completely straight. Please move feet slightly further apart. Keeping arms completely straight. Slowly raise arms out from your sides. Please turn to the side with feet together. Arms completely straight and palms on your side. Please stand still and look straight ahead, not at your phone. Well done. Your body scan is complete. Simple, fast, and effective. So now that we've seen what the scan process looks like, let's go ahead and jump into our app starting with Me360. With Me360, you can create healthy habits, visualize your progress, and overall track yourself better. Some of the features include no photos uploaded to the cloud, all the images stay on the user's device for complete privacy, you get 14 in-app measurements including body composition based off a of size stream's body fat formula, that's the formulas of adipose tissue, it's contact free measuring, no touching involved, as we saw previously you have minimal scan and processing time, and then you can also choose to log and track your body changes over different periods, including a month, three months, and the entire year. So let's see what it would actually look like if you were to go download Me360 today. In this demonstration, you can see there are four tabs down at the bottom. First one we're on is Future Me. The Future Me is a database estimate of your target aspirational body. 
When using that slider, you can actually see what you would look like in different states. The avatar you see is also from your most recent scan. You'll always have two different views as well, a high detail view and a low detail view. Next, you have your measurement screen, which is kind of like your uh, home screen overall. You can see each of these measurements from your most recent scan and actually tap into them individually to see how your progress is going. As mentioned, you can track those over three different states, a month, three months, and a year. If you're interested in seeing just specific measurements, you can go into your manage tile settings, turn some of them off, and then turn other ones on. Next, we have our history tab. In here, you'll find all your historical scans that you've done. You can go back into them individually and actually check out the high detail, the low detail, and each of your measurement states for that specific scan. The other cool part about this is that you can actually compare two scans. So if you were to click on any two scans, those would show up and you can actually interact with the avatar as well, but also see your measurements side by side uh, to see how you've been progressing, either up or down, depending on your goals. The next screen we'll see is actually our goals screen. Now this is an excited one for anyone who actually wants to go through and track their progress. You can choose those individual measurements, put in what you'd like to be, and each time you scan, it'll track your progress towards those goals. So as we can see, I've added in a new waste one, and it's brought my progress down a little bit, but it's also given me something to work towards for each of them. The last screen we'd like to show you is the settings screen. So this is up at the top, and it'll allow you to change your different information uh, that you'd like to share with the app. So next, let's take a look at FormCut, a made-to-measure brand that specializes in menswear. Some of the features of the FormCut app include a customized product selection based off measurements, mobile shopping experience with a visual design interface, contact-free measuring, as do all of our apps, and then also quick and fast scan process overall. So let's go ahead and take a look at what the FormCut app looks like if you were to go ahead and download it today. Similar to Me360, you have multiple tabs down at the bottom of the screen. You have your avatar, your measurements, a way to scan, connect or shop, and then also your history screen as well. So very similar to Me360, you can choose which measurements you'd like to see and turn those on and off. You can also go into your history scan and see how many you've done. You can actually slide individual scans to the left, just like Me360, and delete them as needed. And then the coolest part about this experience is actually you can connect to shop. So let's go ahead and customize a shirt. So as you can see, we have the opportunity to select our fit, fabric, collar, cuff, and pocket. So the first one we're going to start off is with a fit. Now, some people have uh, different fit preferences. For this one, I'm going to go ahead and choose number four, which is a classic fit. Next, we're going to come over to the fabrics. And as we scroll down, you'll be able to see all the different fabrics that are available. And then you can also see that visualized um, shirt right on the edge there that'll show you what you're actually getting. So that's a great look right there. So I'm going to go ahead and stick with that. Next, I'm coming on to my collar. We have four different options there as well. So I'm going to go ahead and click on the classic spread collar. We'll go over to the cuff for additional options. And then lastly, we're going to select if we want a pocket on the shirt or not. Once you have those all selected, you are ready to go. It's a very simple shopping experience. You can go back and change each one as needed. Um, but once you feel that you have everything finalized, you can go ahead and add it to your basket uh, and give it an order. Let's check out SciStream MobileFit. MobileFit is a simple app and interface that allows uniform companies to size their employees anywhere. 
This was designed to relieve the logistical headache of trying to organize sizing events as well as the costs that are associated with them. Not to mention, it's also difficult to get some scanning equipment out to these locations where portability is a must. Let's check out some of the features. No photos uploaded to the cloud. Your images are processed right on the user's device. A simplified registration process where the organization registers the employees themselves. So while the app is available for download by anyone on both Google Play and the App Store, only people who have been registered by their employers and received a login code can actually scan with it. Employers receive size recommendations through a dedicated portal. It's also contact free and takes minimal time out of your day to scan. So we saw the uh, actual mobile scanning process earlier, and this is the interface that you're seeing now. So with MobileFit, the user only gets two options on their screen, one to scan and one to see their history. So while Mead 360 and FormCut can be used by both consumers and businesses, SciStream MobileFit is distinctly a business-to-business -business application. So now that you've seen the features of each app and how they are tailored to their respective industries, it should be noted that each one can also be rebranded and privately labeled to the organizations that are in those spaces. Here's an example of some companies that have used a rebranded version of the FormCut application. So what would be some of the mobile app options that are configurable? Well, in addition to the general customizations related to brand, including logos, fonts, and colors, each one also has options based off their industry. For fitness focused, the 3D avatar, both high detail and low detail with Future Me slider, measurements with drill down graphs, your goals, the scan comparison, and the ability to work with Apple Health Kit or Google Fit. For apparel, the 3D avatar, your measurements, no drill down graphs though. Connect to shop button. Scan to factory option. And then for uniform, invite only registration. Phone number login. And a one time passcode over email or SMS. All right, so we've taken a look at the scan process. We've demoed some of the products. Now, Let's talk about what we can do with the measurements. So after a user scans with one of our applications, they then have the opportunity to share those scans and measurements with other retailers and businesses. It should first be noted that SciStream believes that the consumer or user controls their own data and chooses what to share. With that said, we're also compliant with GDPR and the California Consumer Privacy Act. Now, what are a couple ways a user can actually share their data with another company? Two mechanisms we currently have are either through a hyperlink or with a QR code. Now, depending on which solution a provider chooses, they can either see the user sizes in a scan to factory solution like Ursa, a uniform recommended sizing application, or a more simplified web-based data portal, both of which can be privately labeled. So with Ursa, after a scan has been shared, the software captures the wearer's fit preference and runs sizing logic based on the actual garment specification to produce the best fit size recommendation. The software itself is web-based and it can run on any internet browser and is also ideal for use on tablets managed by the uniform company staff. The size recommendations get stored as orders under the customer's profile, which can then be sent to third-party systems, distribution centers, or suppliers electronically. The whole process is automated, and it eliminates the errors normally associated with hand measuring and also entering data manually into the ordering system. We also have our data portal which is an easy way to receive just the user's core information. So like Ursa, the portal is also web-based and runs on any internet browser. But with this, it has more of a simplified interface, 
So when a user, excuse me, when a user shares their scans, the company will see the date and time of the scan, the user's name, and also their email. In addition to the core measurements listed in the application that the user scanned with, the data portal owner also receives the full list of over 200 measurements that SciStream offers along with the avatar file. So lastly, the export options. With those measurement files and that avatar file, both can be exported as either a CSV or an OBJ respectively. So with that, we wanted to thank you for your time in joining us today at 3D Body Tech for our demo presentation. We're going to go ahead and send it back live for the question and answer portion now. If you haven't done so, we invite you to submit, as, uh, submit your questions within the chat box, and we'll try to answer as many of them as possible. Thank you so much again for joining.